Hey guys, good evening everybody. Chief Meteorologist Patrick Bigby here is a look at your detailed forecast brought to you by Eddie Pearson Roof. And let's go ahead and talk about things uh, over the next several days. We're going to see more sunshine Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. But we will see our temperatures kind of going up and down at times. We're going to cool down into the 50s for your Wednesday. And then we'll see a deeper... Uh, temperature drop as we go into Wednesday night. Overnight lows getting down into the 30s once again. I do expect widespread frost Wednesday night and a Thursday, but it's short-lived. By the end of the week, we're back into the 70s as we warm things up and we'll make it back up into the low 70s for Friday and Saturday. That's also when our next rain chance returns to the area. So we're going to stay dry until Saturday, but that's when things change. What's going to happen? Well, we're going to see an area of low pressure develop also uh, off towards the west across the southern plains as that moves eastward it's going to uh, form and move towards us so we'll see a cold front sweep through the area that'll spark off widespread showers and thunderstorms for your saturday as of right now we're not anticipating anything bad in our area but if that changes we'll let you know uh, as we go towards sunday we may see a few lingering showers during the early morning hours but the clouds will stick around Sunday afternoon as the bulk of the rain moves off towards the east and then we'll dry out into early next week. But there's a look at the temperatures up and down all over the place. We're going to be playing the weather whiplash up, down, cold, warm, you name it. We got it right here as we look ahead over the next seven days. And here is your 10-day forecast. The only real chance of rain on Saturday. Maybe a stray shower Sunday, but Saturday looks to be the best chance of rain here across the area with temperatures into the 70s Saturday afternoon.